Hey guys, it's Miss Crystal here, and this week's theme is nature. So what I have for you guys today is just a simple little project. Um, all you need is a picture, some glue, and just some like leaves and sticks that you can find all around outside. Now, before we begin, there is one important thing. This activity does use using pictures. So please talk to an adult to make sure that you're not using any important pictures. Um, or if they can make a copy of a picture for you, that way you can decorate it. If not, you can take a regular photo, but just don't glue it on, that way nothing's permanent. All right, let's go outside and look for stuff. All right, so as you guys can see here, I've collected a, a bunch of different things like plants and sticks and some rocks from outside. The only thing I would like you guys to make sure when you grab your nature materials is just make sure that there's no bugs using these leaves or these flowers as their home. We don't want to disturb them. They're just trying to do their little bug thing. Uh, second of all, uh, at my house, I know it's been really hot, so I was able to find a lot of kind of dead leaves and some dead grass. Uh, that's okay. We can also use this just kind of break up things. And then I printed out two pictures. I printed out this quick picture of myself and a picture of my cat because I feel like decorating her as well. But first... We're gonna do me. Let's make this interesting. All right, so the first thing I think I wanna do, I've always wondered what I would look like with orange hair. And since I found like these beautiful um, orange petals from a bird of paradise plant we have in my yard, I think what I am going to do is I'm just gonna kind of break the petals up a little bit just to kind of give myself some long beautiful orange hair. I'm not going to do anything. I'm not going to do any gluing until I'm done. That way I know I have the picture I want before I add the permanent glue. Oh. Maybe what we should do is do a little bit at the end of my finger and yeah I think that's oh, almost good. All right, well, now, I think that's a look. What about you guys? Um, and the next is, I'm gonna cover up my feet because I don't like looking at my feet. I'm gonna give myself some little leaf shoes. Let's see, what else can we add? Um, hmm. Maybe using the rest of this leaf. We can give myself a little bit of a leaf skirt. Do that. Add some twigs. Get some more orange in there. Do some of these. Just to kind of fill out the skirt I'm giving myself. All right, and these are my two finished projects. My cat Jelly. I I really liked how hers came out more because I was more for like freehand with it. It also makes sense because she is a diva. And then there's me. I tried right, adding a right. few more things somewhere. to my picture art. to kind of bring it all together. But Maybe again, I didn't really like it as much as the one I did of my cat. Bracelet. But this was a really fun activity and it allows and a lot of creativity. I really like this stick. It's a really nice, long and straight stick. And I want to I want to use it somehow. Maybe what I'll do is, you know how how, how like queens and kings, they have like that that royal scepter. Maybe I'll just have a really long royal staff. 
and I'll use, let's see, do I like this color with it? Or do I like the lighter color? I think I like this more. So I have a bunch of these. We'll just add them around like that. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's looking good. All right, we'll take this big leaf and I kinda wanna give myself a leaf shirt. How do I want to do it? How do I wanna give myself a shirt? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Ooh, like that. And then to make up on the other side, we'll take some of these smaller leaves I have. And just kind of bam, make this a sleeve. Oh yeah, put the hair over. Oh yeah, oh yeah. All right, so I think that's a pretty fierce look, so I'm just gonna go ahead and glue it all together now.